So GameStop sent me a $5 reward certificate, which was expiring in a couple days. So I went down there to see if there's anything that I wanted, and there really wasn't. Um, so I spent a lot more money um, on top of the reward certificate to get this, which is the uh, Legend of Zelda Potion Bottle Light with the European color, uh, European spelling for color. Uh, an official Nintendo product, which is not necessarily something that I would be proud of considering what this is, but it's done by Paladin, Paladin, Palad, whatever, Palad something. Um, nice diagram here of the colors and, you know, what it looks like off. It looks like a plastic bottle, and when it's on, it looks like a Christmas decoration, so. $33. Yeah, so... When we took off the five dollar uh, reward certificate, it was still like twenty nine bucks. Um, I'm just telling you right now. I took this out to put the batteries in ahead of time. It is not worth thirty two bucks. In fact, it's already on. So let's just take this out here, and then if you look at the instructions here. It is completely wrong. I don't know why they would screw up their very own directions, but it says that you unscrew the top and then you unscrew the inner top and then you put the batteries in from the side. I will show you in a minute that is not true. And then you tap it to change lights. So let me reset this one second and put it in front of you here. Get the. First of all, this bottle is, it's thick plastic but you can feel this is cheap like if you were to accidentally drop this the wrong way or your pet knocks it off the shelf this sucker has a very low chance of surviving the drop unless it's on real heavy carpet it's gonna crack same with the uh, LED corkscrew mechanism here just shaking it turns it on you can tell that even though it's kind of weighty it still is not um, not quality so the instructions here claim that you unscrew the top and you load the batteries in from the side that is not true you unscrew this top right here get it to focus there you unscrew this top and then you drop the batteries in from the uh, from the top as well they are nice plus and minus symbols there to show you how to put the batteries in and the more I shape this the more I'm probably gonna break it but uh, so then you unscrew this here you put this in there and there's that I didn't mean to turn you on please turn off and then let's get the lights off here real quick and see what this looks like so it's, it's cool. I mean, don't get me wrong, despite how I'm bashing it, it, it really is a cool thing. It just looks like a Christmas decoration. I mean, there's really nothing special to it and nothing that warranted the $32 price tag. Um, you're definitely buying the brand and not the, the quality, that's for sure. Let it cycle through the colors there and go back to red, I believe. Yep. Um, if you're a super avid, uh, Legend of Zelda fan, and you just want a potion bottle, uh, try and find it for cheap. <laughs> try and find it on, like, eBay or Amazon or a secondhand store or some other place, and try and find it for about $15, so less than 50% what I got charged for this sucker. Um... It's just, it's not quality, I'm sorry to say, but uh, it's it's a nice little thing that to uh, pull out here and there and show off to your friends. Don't show them the price tag, show them the bottle. They'll, they'll go, ooh, and then pass it off. So, <laughs> there you have it, the Legend of Zelda Potion Bottle Light. Definitely not worth the price tag, find it cheap if you can, and um, don't let your pets near it or put it in high places where it's going to get knocked over. Here comes a cat already to knock it over, so there you have it.